Hi, I'm Michael Hart, and I'm a Senior Software Development Engineer at AWS. In this video, I want to tell you about how to install AWS IoT SiteWise Edge on your Siemens Industrial Edge devices. I'll start by talking about what SiteWise and SiteWise Edge are, then move on to the capabilities of SiteWise Edge on Siemens Industrial Edge devices. After that, I'll demonstrate how to set up a SiteWise Edge gateway using Siemens hardware and see some data being ingested. AWS IoT SiteWise is an AWS service for industrial customers that delivers an organized view of live and historical operational insights. You can use it to collect, organize, analyze, and visualize data. SiteWise Edge is the edge component of the service. It runs at the edge to collect the data from machines on the factory floor, then aggregates and processes it locally before sending it to the cloud. SiteWise Edge has just been released into the Siemens App Store. That means it's possible to get the benefits of SiteWise Edge by installing it onto your Siemens Industrial Edge devices. Data can be collected with protocols supported by Siemens, including Siemens S7, Modbus, and Ethernet IP, among others. This can then be connected to an OPC UA server, which is supported by SiteWise Edge, so that all the data can be ingested into SiteWise. Build your solution on Siemens.com. Here we can see the breakdown of levels with the L2 machine level, L3 factory level, and cloud level. Here, the robot arms are sending data into the Siemens Industrial Edge devices. This data is then available in the Industrial Edge device through Siemens connectivity applications, enabling the machine to edge data pipeline. You can configure these applications from Siemens Industrial Edge Management application, or IEM, with apps installed by the Siemens Industrial Edge marketplace. However, in this picture, there's no data being sent into the cloud level. With the release of SiteWise Edge into the Siemens App Store, you can now install SiteWise Edge on each of your IEDs, which can then send data up to SiteWise in the cloud. By doing this, you can use your existing machine to edge connectivity using Siemens Industrial Edge and add edge to cloud connectivity using the SiteWise Edge gateway. Once the data has been connected and is starting to be ingested, it can be used for predictive maintenance, asset monitoring, quality inspection, and energy management applications, both at the edge using Siemens Industrial Edge and in the cloud using SiteWise. The edge can be used to see data and insights at the machine level, and the cloud can be used for aggregated views across production lines or factories. You can use this combined solution for your industrial data lake in the cloud. So how can we set up SiteWise Edge on an industrial edge device? Let's take a look. The first step is to create a new SiteWise Edge gateway. Click the Create Gateway button. Here is the new option to be able to deploy the gateway to Siemens Industrial Edge. If we select this option, we can continue the gateway configuration as normal. I'll use the default options for the publisher and add a data source. I'll use the OPC UA data source. I'll give it a name and paste in the endpoint for my OPC UA data simulator. I'll use the root node and use real time. These options are correct, so I'll click Create Gateway. This will generate a configuration file for me, which I can then use to configure the Siemens Industrial Edge device. The next step is to log in to your Industrial Edge Management application. If you don't have a Siemens account, you'll need to sign up for one and add your Industrial Edge devices to it. Once you're signed in, you can see the launch pad. From here, select Edge Management and browse catalog. Once in the catalog, you'll be able to select the new application, AWS IoT SiteWise Edge. If it's not coming up, click the search catalog and type in SiteWise. I'll select it here and click Install. Now I have the option to upload the configuration file that I previously downloaded from the console. I can click plus and select the configuration file and open. Click next and then select the device that I want to install it on. Click install now. Make sure to read the information box and if you accept it, click install. Then we can view the job status to see how far along the deployment is. We can see the job is pending. We can keep clicking refresh until the job has completed. If you're having issues troubleshooting your connection, 
there are two options for viewing logs. First, you can sign in to the console for your industrial edge device. You can then select the installed application and click download logs. Alternatively, you can browse to the management section, select the application and then scroll down. Click show more and show more to be able to access the logs directory. This will contain all of the logs for the components that constitute SiteWise Edge. The job status is now completed, which means that SiteWise Edge has been successfully installed onto the industrial edge device. We can verify this by taking a look at the gateway in IoT SiteWise. We can see that the gateway is connected and everything is green, including our data source. We can also take a look at our data streams, which is where the data will be coming in. Small asset 1 is the value that's being simulated. If we tick two of these measurements and click two data streams selected, we can see that values have started to arrive that were captured using the Siemens Industrial Edge device. That's the demonstration complete. Overall, we've talked about SiteWise, SiteWise Edge, and using Siemens Industrial Edge. We've talked about how Siemens Industrial Edge can be used for machine level data with SiteWise in the cloud providing aggregated views across production lines or factories. We've also seen how to install SiteWise Edge on a Siemens Industrial Edge device and ingest data from it. I hope you now have all the information you need to set up SiteWise Edge on your Siemens Industrial Edge devices.